Hey guys, what is up? This is Pushka Dua from Gadget Geeks. I know <clears throat> it is a quite while I have stopped uh, making videos for quite a while. But don't worry, I'm back with a very, very, very brand new ROM that's called a Pound ROM with Android version 4.4 .4 on Galaxy S2. I've been using Galaxy S2 since, um, I guess, a month, for a month. Uh, whatever. It's so, it's a new ROM. Pound ROM for Galaxy S2. So here it is. Um, we have new 4.4 lock screen. We can use widgets on the screen, add more widgets. Like I generally use calculator, so I have calculator widget on my home screen. And this is camera widget. It's just like iPhone iOS 7. If you just wanna uh, click some photos. You can click pics right from the lock screen without display, uh, displaying all the other data. You you see uh, it is locked. The other data is locked, and that's more of a f its feature. Just uh, let's uh, move it, move on to it uh, next time. Okay, so here's what it is. Um, let's unlock. Oops. Okay, I just unlocked my phone his notification bar that's probably Google now and you have notification panel okay this is um, that would be your personal card or the picture I don't have a uh, picture right now the brightness option settings uh, that is Wi-Fi keys uh, that are called radio buttons I guess yeah radio buttons and we have the torch option here can access directly the torch. I don't do probably uh, that would be handy for you. And the best thing I like in this room, actually not best thing I would say, but yeah, quite interesting thing, is we have a camera button here. You see that won't open a camera, but actually it will activate the camera right from the notification bar. So you can click the pics right from here. Um, let's show it to you. If you just tap it the images and and you can just check out your gallery gallery and uh, you'll see that you have the images clicked right from there it's camera okay so you see uh, I have these images clicked right from my notification bar and um, what new we have in this room is um, we have Google now. We can access Google now by just swiping it from left to right to the le on leftmost screen. We have Google now. The latest option Google has added to this is we can say OK Google to search. Let me just show it to you. OK Google. OK Google. Yeah, that probably uh, doesn't work sometimes, but yeah, it um, generally works for me. Uh, maybe two times from three uh, two in the three times okay uh, well I don't think Google really works well with Indian accent but still now the default messaging app in Android 4.4 is these uh, hangouts this hangouts app you can send uh, messages SMS right from your hangouts app you don't need another uh, SMS app so um, you have a new dialer here which uh, you can access the access the uh, contact from clicking the photos and if you want to just dial just click the contact name I don't have a sim right installed here okay so what's new here um, um, let me just take you to the about phone page because everybody's just excited to see Android 4.4 yay KitKat <laughs> okay so it's nice K here KitKat and you can just press here for Android 4.4 KitKat and here we are 
I really like this thing that Android gives in the latest firmware. It's, it's nice little, um, you can call it game or whatever. But yeah, nice. Okay, so it's Android 4.4, base band, whatever, kernel 3.0.101, CM11. Okay, it is CM11 based, unofficial, pound ROM. You can access super user developer options, printing, accessibility. It's okay. As you can see, I have uh, transition effects. I don't know if it is a transition effects or whatever. Uh, let me just see what it is called exactly. I don't know. So yeah, you can select uh, the default home screen. It can be launcher, Apex launcher, or whatever you want. You can install more. You can select lock screen. Slide shortcuts, clock widget, widget paper. You can install more themes for system UI. And in the interface menu, you have status bar, show clock, center clock option, battery status style. So, all that extra stuff for customization. So, you can customize it your own way. And you have a AOKP custom system animation. Yeah, that was system animation. Okay, we have recent RAM bar here. If you just ins uh, enable it, you can see recent RAM here. If you can see it, you have 402 MB used RAM, 389 free. Yep, quite RAM is just free in this room. I really like this room. You have list view animation. Okay, that was list view animation. It is like wave from left. And list view interpolator is anticipate overshoot interpolator. So I'll just open up my contacts to show you how is it. Um, nope. It's not what I want to show you. Um, 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 um. Just uh huh. Okay, any other list would do actually. We don't need contacts. You have default music player as Google Play Music. You don't have Samsung or any music player. I'm quite disappointed with that. I don't know, I really like that music player. Okay, and if you can see you say uh, you see a wave kind of thing in scrolling that's what I'm telling about talking about it's list view animation really nice and you can use normal widgets on your home screen you have halo option is it halo or yeah halo I don't uh, really know what it is I have never used halo but it is kind of uh, something to do with notifications and all uh, maybe pinning uh, you can pin the app I don't know I have not used this app and what else do we have here Apollo music player few music players I really like these apps I have more apps installed on it um, it's a quite light room and really fast so okay let me just show you the camera app sorry I'm uh, right now I'm not prepared <laughs> to show this Chrome to you um, actually not very well in the sequence or whatever but still you can have a pretty good look over here you have Android 4.4 camera with three options um, just normal camera video and panorama okay this is uh, we have more options here the exposure value color effect um, switch camera use flash or not this is smart capture I think smart capture would probably use um, uh, voice something voice things I don't know. I, I really don't know. I'm quite a, not updated with the technology these days. 
I'm quite I was quite busy with my exams and studies so we have all the updated apps and at 4.4 CM11 unofficial pound ROM so I'll be making more reviews soon and probably the better reviews right now I was not prepared but yeah that is just okay and yep I'll be back with more reviews most probably on Samsung Galaxy S3 I purchased Samsung Galaxy S3 and uh, I'll review I guess a smartphone revolution ROM now I don't know but yeah quite of uh, quite a lot of stuff coming soon so see ya soon people this is Pushkadua from Gadget Geeks please subscribe comment like my video okay I'll be back soon Take care. Bye-bye.